hello friends i am mukesh singh uh, welcome to my channel and today we are going to deploy view uh, view js application over amazon s3 bucket uh, this is the application which we created in uh, uh, one of our previous video and i am going to put the link in the description box you can go and check it out so for deploying uh, a view application in uh, amazon s3 bucket first thing is we, we need to create the build so for this we are going to do npm run build and it is going to create the build and it's running once the build is done uh, yeah it's done it will be uh, added into dist folder let me open the folder so here is this dist folder up uh, here uh, all the build uh, the files which we are needed for deploying the application are here so uh, so this part is done and uh, now let me open uh, the amazon s uh, console aws console uh, so now we have our uh, uh, AWS my, uh, management console is open so I have s3 bucket here in my recently visited services uh, but if you don't have it here you can go and find it here in storage so I'll click on s3 so here the first thing which we are going to do is uh, we'll create a bucket so I'll click on here and I'll give name and uh, the main thing which we are going to do is uh, uh, uncheck this block all public access and when we do uh, this unchecking block all public access uh, amazon will ask to acknowledge like uh, we are doing it uh, by knowingly unknowingly we are not unchecking it so we acknowledge it then create bucket so now now the bucket is created uh, what we are going to do is we are going to upload uh, the build files so open and click on upload so what i'll do is i'll drag and drop the files so here we have the files what i'll do is i'll select all and i'll just drag it and drop it here and click upload it's uploaded now uh, the next thing is uh, we'll go to properties and here we have static website hosting so we'll click on it it has this radio button uh, use this bucket to host a website so we'll check this here it asks for uh, index doc uh, document so it will be index dot html and as we don't have any error, uh, error page, we'll just give index.html here also. And we will come down and we'll save it. So most of the things are done here, but when we open it, it's saying access denied. Though we had given the permission, but we uh, it is still saying access denied. We need to give some more permissions. So we'll come to permissions. And here we have access control list. So in access control, we have public access. So in public access, we'll give a read bucket permissions. So, and save it still it's not going to work if we go here and still it's not working so one more thing we need to go uh, do is uh, we'll go to our bucket and we'll select all the items and uh, actions and here we'll make it public so we made it public and now when we go here and refresh so now we are getting our page which uh, we had built. So here we can do all the operations which we we were doing it. 
And now if you go here in uh, AWS console, here it shows that uh, AWS is not happy with the public permission, but it's fine. Now we can give objects uh, a read public information uh, uh, access, uh, which is not going to harm. So that's it. Uh, thanks everyone. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and you can uh, uh, comment with your feedbacks what you liked and uh, what are your suggestions for future videos. So don't forget to subscribe my channel so that you don't miss any uh, uh, videos from me. So thank you.